Hello. Hi. So this is our specialty. Yes. What's it called again? It's a uh, yeah. Flowering thinking tea cones. So we're pouring it here. So you can watch with us as it flowers. Yeah. We're excited. I think they I'm look excited. really cool. Yes. Show them it dry. Um, if you can see it, I don't know. And this is what it looks like wet. Kind of like... The same thing. Except it's getting spiky. Yeah. Oh, it's flowering. Oh, that's so cool. You can see all of it starting to unfurl. Mm. I don't know if it, how cool this looks for you guys watching, but for me... Oh, yeah. That is pretty cool. It is fascinating. Reminds me of a sci-fi movie. Totally. Or, um, you never played the Mass Effect video game series, did you? Mm, no. They had, a, they had a ship that kind of expanded like that. Okay. Yeah. Very cool. Very cool. Well, let's start yes. the other ones. Let's start the other ones while this... You can't put it in the front. No, I don't see it. While this happens. <laughs> All right. I we, just remembered. I'm like, I hope our heads are in this. They should be. They should be. Um, we don't have anything to put this on. Yes, we do. This. Good. All right. We're good. We're good. Um, this is our third video today, guys. Be, be chill. I'm sure they're fine. Good. Okay, let's start with this one. Sure. Almond sugar cookie dessert. I think this is the one I was most excited for. It was. It's the one that smells ridiculously decadent. It smells really good um, and, and it's very pretty. When I opened the bag up, it was like it has some, yeah. some reds and, and yellows. It's a very pretty looking Yeah, it is. Mm, it just smells so good. You're never going to see this, but I will show it to you anyways. And there will be pictures on the blog. There are, yeah, there will be. Look at that. Yeah, it's really cool. Looks like a pine cone. All right, so almond sugar pine cone. <laughs> Want to say anything about? Oh that? yes, yes. Uh, the almond sugar cookie dessert. Des <laughs> des dessert. This gorgeous tea is the perfect caffeinated indulgence. Strong black tea gets the sweet treatment with toasted almonds and almond sugar cookie, mm. while the chocolatey and slightly mm -hmm. smoky flavor of safflower, that must be what I saw the little red petals of, mm -hmm. the flavor of safflower balances everything out. Try it on its own or add warm milk to further its decadence. Mm -hmm. We will be doing that in the future. Yeah. Uh, contains black teas, almonds, almond sugar cookie flavoring, and safflower blossoms. It's very good. High caffeine. It's very good. Oh, I need that. I will note that it's a three minute steep time, but honestly, Charlie, Jewel, that's not us. We just like leaving our tea in. Yeah. And we're not going to change. We tried it, <laughs> but we're not going to change. No, we like strongly steep teas. Mmm. Okay. Yeah. I like that a lot. And I know that with milk, uh -huh. that's a great tea. Yeah. Love this tea. Love this tea. Very good. All right, next we Ooh. have white chocolate peppermint. Mm. Also sounds delicious. It does. This delicious caffeine-free tea tastes like an indulgence without the guilt. Green rooibos is given the holiday treatment with organic cacao Ooh. nibs and a kiss of peppermint. You did it too. <laughs> well, I wasn't expecting it. Yeah, you, me neither. <laughs> if you watch our unboxing video, I did the same thing. Cacao nibs. <laughs> <laughs> Beautifully balanced and rich. It's been a long time since we unboxed this. It was. Uh, try it with warm milk and perhaps your favorite piece of chocolate mm. on the side. Are you going to try it? Yeah. It's got green rooibos, cacao nibs, white chocolate peppermint flavoring, and organic white cornflower petals. Oh, that's nice. Mmm. Yeah, it tastes like white chocolate, but uh, and peppermint. I like that a lot. Hmm. It smells like rooibos. Yeah, it tastes like rooibos too. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. It's interesting. Interesting. I think this should be used with a different steeper, since I'm eating grass. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think I'd like it a little stronger. Okay. Good to know. For me personally. Yeah. But overall, the, the taste is, is nice. It's mm -hmm. very refreshing. 
Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. But I would like a stronger flavor. A little bit more. Flavor. Mm -hmm. And that's another thing we've noticed, uh, is that generally we like a little bit more tea than, than they say to. You mean more than eight ounces? More than, well, yes, more than eight ounces, but also more than one teaspoon per eight ounces. Yeah. Because we found a lot of them were a little weaker. Yeah. For us, for our preferences, especially with such a small steep time. But anyways. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's longer than my dad ever steeps his tea. <laughs> well, he likes peppermint. It doesn't require a lot of steeping. Doesn't it? Doesn't. Okay. Next, uh, we have the caramel toffee pooer. We should have looked up how to pronounce it. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Rich and velvety, this pooer is great for a pick-me-up to aid in digestion, hence pooer, and serves as a delicious dessert all in one. Notes of toasted pistachio and hazelnut are at the forefront, while creamy caramel and buttered toffee sweeten the deal. Excellent on its own or further richened with a dash of warm milk. Ingredients, pooer tea, natural flavor, and blackberry leaf. Blackberry leaf? Interesting. Blackberry leaf, I think, is pretty good for a person. I didn't know. Uh, if it's anything like raspberry leaf. All right. Try the pooer. <laughs> I will. Ooh, so cool. It smells really good. Now, this one, they say to steep it for six to eight minutes, mm. and I think it's been about that long, but it is a longer steep time. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> mm. It doesn't have that that bitterness of black tea. Oh, no, it's not bitter at all. No, it's very smooth. And then that little sweetness, it's not like bitter and sweet at the same time. It's like smooth. Smooth and sweet. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's all. That's um, a very nice tea. Yes. I'm a huge fan of the pooer tea. <laughs> It'll aid in digestion. <laughs> okay. Oh, boy. Okay. So now we have the flowering thing king tea cones. Yes. Uh, these, which can me, be re-steeped. Do you want me to read about it? Yeah, let's do it. I'll these exquisite cool. little black tea cones were handmade from the highest quality Feng King Dian Hong black tea from Yunnan, China. Buttery, malty, and naturally sweet, this deliciously fun tea is meant to be steeped multiple times. Watch your tea cone unfurl like a flower when brewed. A perfect fit for our chic glass teapots. That's, no, that's not the teapot. Well, it's chic and it's glass and it's theirs. So. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Ingredients, black tea. 2022 harvest, so it's of this year. For one more day only. That's nice. Not too excited about it though. Well, we've had three cups of candy tea. <laughs> and then we had this regular black tea, which is very nice. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Yeah. Yeah, you should try it. As far as the black tea goes, it's great. Uh oh. Damn. Well, just add it to the mix. Okay, it's added to the mix. There's been so much spilled. Oh yeah, Water now I look here. at the rest of the table, I don't feel as bad. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It smells like... It smells like... Tea. Yeah. Yeah. Um... I think on its own, like in a vacuum, I'd love it. But after having the white chocolate peppermint, the almond sugar cookie dessert, and then the pooer tea, it's not a favorite. But yeah. in a vacuum, I think I would love it. And with milk, okay. with milk, yeah. It, it's, it's got quite a, a bitterness to it. It does, it's especially fine. comparatively, but yeah. yeah. Um, That's it. That is it. That's it. Um, yeah. That's all of them. Basically, if we keep filming now, it's just going to be us putting milk in these bad boys and drinking them. <laughs> anyway, so that's uh, Tea Runners, December 2022, our tea tasting. Yep. Um, we still recommend Tea Runners, 100%, as far as I know. 100%. Yeah. This caramel toffee pooer is 
Mm -hmm. So good. I, I actually just gifted my brother a three month subscription for his birthday. Ooh, how nice. Yeah. It's nice for him. It is. <laughs> All right, thank you for joining. Thank you. And goodbye. Goodbye.